Mm-hmm. All right, so speaking on conflict resolution, yeah. how do you have conflict resolution in your relationship? Like, what is your steps? I think the number one step I feel that, and I've gotten better over the years, um, is truly addressing the problem as soon as it is made known. Um, I, th- I feel that if you wait on things or you allow them to fester or you're not verbally speaking up, because I think my problem initially, and I still deal with it, you know, I'm working on because I'm aware of it now, is that one of the things that stemmed from my childhood traumas was people pleasing. And sometimes you, you get afraid because if I say this, it's going to give them a different conception about me and it's going to hurt the relationship more. But to be honest, even me and you spoke about it, Makai, remember? He was like, yo, man, remember we used to hold our tongues all the time? And it's like, I'd rather speak out and say it is what it is than to hold my tongue. And then it's everything gets just a, a, a misunderstanding kind of a mess. You know, rather hash it out, talk it out, make it aware to you and the other party. And then you can see what both of your thoughts or views are on this. And then you can proceed from there. But I think the number one most important thing is addressing it. I think right off the bat.